Hi everyone, welcome to AutoGPT Tutorials. Today, I'm going to be talking about LangChain. LangChain is a powerful tool that can be used to create a wide variety of applications using large language models, LLMs. In this video, I will explain what LangChain is, how to use it, and some of the things you can do with it. But that's not all, we have plenty of other exciting updates and tutorials to share with you in the future. So make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Without further ado, let's dive into today's video. What is LangChain? LangChain is a software development framework designed to simplify the creation of applications using large language models, LLMs. LangChain provides a number of features that make it easy to use LLMs, including LangChain provides a standard interface for interacting with LLMs. This makes it easy to switch between different LLMs and to use multiple LLMs in the same application. LangChain provides a variety of tools for building and evaluating applications. These tools include a code editor, a debugger, and a test suite. LangChain has a large community of users and developers. This community provides support and resources for users of LangChain. How to use LangChain? Easy to use LangChain, you first need to install it. You can do this by following the instructions on the LangChain website. Once you have installed LangChain, you can start building applications by creating a LangChain project. A LangChain project is a collection of files that define your application. These files include the code for your application, as well as the configuration for your LLMs. Once you have created a LangChain project, you can start building your application. You can use the LangChain tools to help you build your application, and you can also get help from the LangChain community. In upcoming videos, we are creating LangChain applications, then I will share you everything how to install and use. LangChain modules? LangChain provides some core modules for building blocks of any LLM-powered application. Number 1. Models Modules The Models module provides a generic interface for interacting with large language models, LLMs. It also provides a variety of tools for working with LLMs, such as prompt management and prompt optimization. Number 2. Prompts Modules The Prompts module provides a way to generate prompts for LLMs. Prompts are instructions that tell the LLM what to do. For example, you could use a prompt to tell the LLM to generate a poem or to answer a question. Number 3. Indexes Modules Indexes language models become much more powerful when combined with application-specific data. This module contains interfaces and integrations for loading, querying, and updating external data. Number 4. Memory Modules The memory module provides a way to store data in memory. This can be useful for storing data that you need to access quickly, such as the results of a search query. Number 5. Chains Modules the Chains module provides a way to chain together multiple LLMs to create more complex applications. For example, you could use Chains to create a chatbot that can answer questions about a variety of topics. Number 6 Agents Modules The Agents module provides a way to create agents that can interact with the world. Agents are software programs that can make decisions and take actions. For example, you could create an agent that can book a flight or that can order food. Number 7. Callback Modules Callbacks let you log and stream the intermediate steps of any chain, making it easy to observe, debug, and evaluate the internals of an application. LangChain Use Case LangChain can be used to create a wide variety of applications, including Chatbots. Chatbots are computer programs that can simulate conversation with human users. LangChain can be used to create chatbots that can answer questions, provide customer service, or even just chat for fun. Autonomous Agents. AutoGPT. Autonomous Agents are long-running agents that take many steps in an attempt to accomplish an objective. Examples include AutoGPT and BabyAGI. Personal Assistance one of the primary LangChain use cases. Personal assistants need to take actions, remember interactions, and have knowledge about your data. 
Question answering, another common Langchain use case. Answering questions over specific documents, only utilizing the information in those documents to construct an answer. Querying tabular data, recommended reading if you want to use language models to query structured data, CSVs, SQL, data frames, etc. Code understanding, recommended reading if you want to use language models to analyze code. Interacting with APIs, enabling language models to interact with APIs is extremely powerful. It gives them access to up-to-date information and allows them to take actions. Summarization, compressing longer documents. A type of data augmented generation. Evaluation, generative models are hard to evaluate with traditional metrics. One promising approach is to use language models themselves to do the evaluation. And more. If you are interested in learning more about Langchain, I encourage you to check out the following resources, all links available in the description. The Langchain website, langchain.com. The Langchain documentation, docs.langchain.com. The Langchain GitHub repository, github.com slash hwchase17 slash langchain. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials on Langchain and Langchain-related projects. You can also follow me on social media for updates on my latest work. Thank you again for watching.